which is the first and the only one in the world at the moment electric fire truck that was ever been built. It's the only one, it's not for sale, it's worth a lot, <laughs> and it's just for demonstration purposes, building the serial production vehicles uh, as we speak. Over the last uh, couple of years, uh, we've been heavily engaged with our carbon recovery ordinance here in Eugene. So one of the efforts is to, can we electrify uh, a lot of the technologies and emerging technologies out there. Uh, Rosenbauer presented this product uh, about a year ago, and um, it's in its uh, developmental phase uh, right now, and we had the opportunity to uh, demo and tour that vehicle today. Technology such as this, as well as with apparatus such as Arcimoto, which is a local vendor here, uh, can provide us some opportunities to uh, reduce our carbon footprint while uh, providing the same or higher or better level of service uh, to our community. So this is the very first fire truck in history that was designed from a white piece of paper. We manufacture everything, the chassis, the superstructure, the pump, the monitors, the, the control system, the software, which is unique. It's the first time that a truck was designed as a fire truck from scratch. Everything else was just kind of a yeah, halfway solution, adding a little bit of a structure to a, an existing transport vehicle. Did you ever think there'd be a day when we'd have an electric fire truck running around? Well, I think uh, I, I stopped uh, years ago saying we've stopped em uh, evolving. And uh, it's interesting, uh, people are like, well, you know, are we gonna go to an electric fire truck? And I go, well, are we back to the port where we transitioned from horses to internal combustion? And now are we going internal combustion to electric? The future was to see and to tell.